Hi, in this tutorial, I will show you the integration process of Google Sheet and send data through bid integrations. At first, open the bid integrations dashboard and click on create integration button to create an integration. Now select any trigger of your preference that you want to connect with Google Sheet. I am selecting user registration. After completing these steps, the actions will appear on a new page. Now search and select Google Sheet from the actions pages that you want to integrate with your selected task or form. Here you can set the integration name of your preference. Here you have to set client ID and secrets. To get the client ID and secrets open your Google Developer Console. You have to go to your Google Developer Console links in the description below. In the console dashboard, navigate to library. Then enable Google Sheet API and Google Drive API. Select Credentials and Create Credentials. Now click OAuth Client ID, then select Application Type Web Application. Gives a client name as your preference. In the Authorized JavaScript, Origins section, click on the Add URI button. Now go to the Bitform dashboard and copy the home page URL and paste it into URI's field. Then authorized redirect URI section click on the Add URI button. Now go to the Bitform dashboard and copy the authorized redirect URI's and paste it into URI's field. After paste two URI's then click the Create button. Now choose your OAuth 2.0 client ID and copy your client secret and paste Bitform dashboard. Now click on the Authorize button. After successfully authorizing and click on the next button. Select the specific spreadsheet from the drop-down menu which you have created before on Google Sheet. Then select the worksheet that belongs to the selected spreadsheet. Now specify the header row. By default, the first row of the worksheet is considered as a header row and click on the refresh button. You can now map the form fields with the necessary Google fields. After mapping the desired fields, click on Next. To save the integration process, click on Finish and Save. Now go to your selected task or form and type some information and save.
Bit integration has an option in every integration called timeline, where you can check integration success or error status. Also check your Google Sheet. Thanks for watching our video.